Hey y'all, welcome to my curls. Have I got a solution for you? I have got a life hack. I have a major problem. It's a problem that I have in the winter. I bet you all have this problem. I know so many people that do, and I have a solution for you. Simple, easy, cheap solution to a big problem. It's a big problem for me, and I have a life hack, so I want to share it with you. So welcome to my curls. I'm in my bedroom on my bed because that's where this hack takes place, so I thought this was the appropriate place to tell you about it. And so let's get going. I'm excited to tell you about this hack. So I live in Kentucky and something happens to me every single year the minute it turns cold here. And it is like clockwork. You can set your watch by this happening. And I've kind of, this has been happening for probably I don't know, 20 or 25 years, the majority of my adult life or as much that I can remember. As soon as we turn on the heat in our house, this happens to me. I get little cracks in my skin around my cuticle, not really down here at the base, but up here in the corners of my fingers and around on and on the tips of my fingers I get little cracks in the skin or where the the fingernail meets the skin and they hurt I almost said a cuss word because these little stinking cuts and cracks hurt like nothing else I have ever experienced and I'm not kidding the minute we turn the heat on in our house I get a, a cut in my cuticle. So as you all know, we've been at the beach. It was hot in Kentucky. It was hot at the beach in Florida. We got home on a Friday night. It was super cold in Kentucky. There was a cold front that came through. Fall is here and we turned the heat on in our house. When I woke up Saturday morning, I have one of these on my finger. And I don't know why it happens. It has something to do with the temperature and the heat being on in our house. And there have been times when I have had a cut on every single finger and they hurt so bad, like I can't pick stuff up. It is, has been before to the point that I'm almost in tears because they hurt so bad. And I would love to know if this happens to you. Like I mentioned it to some people and they have never had this and then I run into other people and I can see it on their fingers in the winter. And when I do notice people with this, I always tell them my hack. And I'm going to do a close-up video so that you all can see because I have one right now. I've never found anything that has stopped this from happening. I have put lotion on my fingers. Like every time I would wash my hands, I would just lather on all different kinds of healing lotion and ointment and all of these things to try to prevent this from happening or to heal the cuts on my fingers. Sometimes when the cuts have been really bad, I would put like an antibiotic, a, a, like a neosporin on my fingers and wrap band-aids around my fingertips and go to bed at night to try to get them to heal. Nothing has helped this. I have not been able to stop the cracks. I have not been able to heal the cracks until I learned this life hack. Y'all, it works. Now, let me tell you one thing. This product is a preventative product. If you get a crack, it's not gonna heal the crack. It will make the crack feel better, but it will not make it go away. So this is something that you have to do to prevent the cracks from happening. And you're gonna be, you're gonna be shocked when I show you what it is, but here it is. A and D diaper rash cream. That's it. Last night I was getting in bed. I'd wash my face. The crack was hurting and I had I'm like, okay. And my husband said, well, get out the cream. It, now's the time for the cream. We turned the heat on. Like he knows that this is going to happen to me and he knows that this is my solution. I can sort of feel when I have a crack coming on and so once we get deep into winter, I do this every single night. 
right now this time of year when it's just starting I do it on the fingers that I can feel something happening but again this is preventative it is not a cure but what I do every single night is I slather it around the tips of my fingers and I rub it in really good and it doesn't rub in like lotion it's gonna stay on the surface of your finger and then I just take a Kleenex and I wipe off what got on my fingernail or if I have any excess or whatever so it's not getting on my bed and I sleep with this A&D diaper rash cream on my fingers and I swear by this since I have discovered this life hack I no longer well I can't say that I do still sometimes get them if I go several days in a row and I don't use this stuff I will have a crack up here if it's if it's cold or um, if I've been washing my hands a lot but for the most part this stuff there's Maxie <laughs> he's gonna bark but for the most part this I'm just gonna keep on talking because he won't stop barking for the most part this diaper rash cream has has stopped me from getting the cracks on my fingers and for the a couple bucks this cost it is definitely worth a try if you're somebody that gets the cracks around your cuticle it is something also that you're gonna want to do for I'm just gonna say probably a week before you know if it's working for you and now last night like I said I did have a crack and I put some on there this morning the crack definitely feels better it's not gone I can still look at my finger and see it and the crack kind of gets hardened around the edges and sometimes will actually like splinter and peel I'm trying to record a video in here <laughs> I'm talking about my crack. <laughs> Guys. Talking about my crack cream. <laughs> Until you two busted in. Have you eaten? No, I'm waiting on you. I'll be there in just one second. Anyway, if you're somebody who gets these cracks on your finger, give it a try. I would please let me know if this works for you. Um, until I got this out of my cabinet last night, I'm like, I need to talk about this. Well, Y'all, it's worth a shot. But if you do it, let me know. I want to know if this works for you. This is a fantastic little product. So, there it is. There is my life tip, my problem-solving moment, my super secret hack just for you. I hope you've enjoyed that. Give the video a thumbs up and let me know if it works. So, until next time, I'll see you later.